The safety of our children, young people and staff remains my top priority. That's why all staff and children, including the under fives, will have access to testing if they develop symptoms of coronavirus. This will enable the right response where a case is confirmed, including using a test and trace approach to rapidly identify people most at risk of having been exposed to the virus so that they can take action too. We continue to follow the best scientific advice and believe that this cautious, phased return is the most sensible course of action to take. While we are not able to welcome all primary children back for a full month before the summer, we continue to work with the sector on the next steps, where we'd like to see schools have, who have the capacity to bring back more children in those smaller class sizes to do so if they are able to do before the summer holidays. We will be working to bring all children back to school in September. I know students who are due to take exams in 2021 will have experienced considerable disruption to their education this year, and we are committed to doing all we can to minimise the effects of this. Exams will take place next year, and we're working with Ofqual and the exam boards on our approach to these. While these are the first steps, they are the best way to ensure all children can get back into the classroom as soon as possible. 